So a lot of people have been affected by this issue where in VGC services can't start, it returns with error function one. And whenever you start Valorant, you receive the same issue of um, a Vanguard anti-cheat having to reinstall with the reboot required message. So we, before we get onto the actual solution, there are some preliminary steps which we have to follow. First being going to command prompt by going to the search box, typing in CMD, right clicking command prompt and hitting run as administrator. We have to enter the following command to make sure Windows 10 is not on test mode, which is our BC edit set test signing off. Hit enter. We should return the operation completed successfully. Let's close that off. The second step we have to do is verify our drivers. You can do this two ways, either typing in a command SIGVERIF and hit and run or you can do this in CMD there will be more information on that in the description so if we follow what it says here to maintain the integrity of your system if it's signed or not hit start this is essentially going to check for unsigned drivers it could take up to a few minutes hopefully not too long That we have it. it says your files have been scanned and verified as digitally signed so that's not a problem um, if you don't receive this prompt box and there are files sorry drivers which are unsigned what you have to do is either update those files download the newest version of those files or delete them all together there'll be a uh, link on how to do that as well now to get onto the actual solution what we're going to do is download the old version of Riot Vanguard and essentially replace what we have already. So there's a link in the description to a Dropbox folder. We're going to click that and it should prompt a download. I've downloaded this about four times. It shouldn't take too long if we open this up. So these are the files you already have in your normal Vanguard, except for the files we've downloaded now are from a previous version. As you can see here, it's exactly the same. So the next step is to basically delete everything we have in our Vanguard folder. So wherever you downloaded Vanguard, write Vanguard, it, it, it just uninstall it, either by clicking uninstall or you can go into add remove programs I like doing it this way and then hitting uninstall clicking yes you'll have a message saying this will completely uninstall right vanguard from your computer blah 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 click continue and hopefully that should go now that is gone we can double check that yep it's gone from my C drive as you can see here completely empty yep it's gone so the next thing we have to do is create a new folder in your C drive program files or wherever Riot Vanguard was before exactly the same Riot Vanguard so I made a new folder here double click this it's empty of course and we need to extract all our files which we downloaded into the new folder we created I shouldn't take too long so now that's done the next step is we need to run VGC as administrator so if we right click this hit run as administrator click yes and then we're going to give it about 10 seconds and then we are going to restart our machine So it's been about 10 seconds. I'm going to restart my machine and resume this video. Now we've restarted a machine. 
we can check for our services if we gc is there so if we type in services in the search box open that up and we see vgc here it's currently set to manual what we need to do is right click vgc hit properties startup type change that to automatic hit apply hit ok now we need to reboot one more time for this to take place so that's what we're going to do and then resume this video once more Okay, I hope everyone's reboot successfully. Now we can check if Vanguard is actually working. So if we type in services again, we look for VGC, it's now running. Whereas before it would return error code, uh, error code one. Now we can see if this actually starts. So if we hit Valorant. Just gonna sign in really quickly. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. Yep, there we go. We hit play. And hopefully this works. I mean, it would have been awkward if it didn't work. It would have been such a waste of a video, but there we go. And we're in. Well, there's a solution. It's probably the only solution that's been working for me. Other solutions work for other people. Well, I mean, it took me three days to find the solution. Uh, credit to Zact N N T, I think, or NS, which, which found the solution on Reddit. Um, if you have any questions, just pop it in the comments and I'll be more than happy to help you.